Hi everybody. We're going to write down the nth term suggested by the pattern. These all involve alternating signs, meaning we have a plus, minus, plus, minus, plus, minus on all of these problems. And the way you take care of that is you use this. A sub n equals negative 1 to the n plus 1. So, for example, if I have a sub 1, a sub 2, a sub 3, a sub 4, and so forth, when I plug in my index number here at the 1, I'm going to get negative 1 to the 1 plus 1, which is negative 1 squared, which makes this positive. However, if I plug in a even number, so I get 2 plus 1, that's going to be negative 1 cubed, and when you cube a negative, you get negative. So anytime I'm plugging in an even number in this formula here, I'm going to get um, a negative when I plug in the odd these, I will get a, a positive one. So just remember this sign here, this pattern, because we're going to use it all the time. And next we have, uh, oh, what did I do with this one? Okay, so, oh, this one looks like it's not alternating, but the way you want to write this is write it as 1, 2 to the negative 1, 3, 4 to the negative 1, 5, 6 to the negative 1, 7, and 8 to the negative 1. So that suggests our pattern if we write this out as a sub 1, a sub 2, a sub 3, a sub 4, and so forth. The 1 and all that matches, so basically we get n. Because that all, um, these numbers match. However, um, my exponent is going from positive 1 to negative, positive 1 to negative, positive 1 to negative, and so forth. So we're just going to use the uh, term for alternating sequence, which is negative 1 to the n minus 1. And that would be your answer. Okay? And the next one, um, this has the alternating uh, sequence. So I'm going to immediately just put negative 1 to the n minus 1. So when I plug in 1, I'm going to get 1. So this is just going to be to the n. Because this is just going by 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So actually, once you use this, you can kind of ignore the positives and negatives and just fill in your formula here, the n term. Okay, here we have 1. It looks like if I put uh, a sub 1, a sub 2, a sub 3, a sub 4, a sub 5, and I'm saying a sub 1. I'm saying it like that. So basically, I know it's alternating, so I'm going to go ahead and write my negative 1 to the n minus 1. And now I can kind of ignore the negatives, the positives and negatives, and just look at what's happening. It looks like... We're just uh, multiplying, so um, multiplying our index by 2. So that would be 2 times 1. This one would be 2 times 2. This would be 2 times 3, and so forth. So it's just going to be 2n. Okay, I have a couple here. Um, it's alternating, so I'm immediately going to uh, write my negative, my alternating sign. And then I know that this is a sub 1, a sub 2. I'm going to ignore the signs now. And I know the new... Let me move this down a little bit. Okay, sorry. Move this down a little bit. So we get negative 1 to the n minus 1. I know these match. So that's just going to be n. Okay, and the denominator is one more 
than the numerator. So that's going to be n plus 1, and all these numbers are 2's, so that would be squared. The same thing's going to happen with this one. We have a sub n. It has all. We're going to use our alternating sign. Uh, the numbers match, but in this case we have cubed. So that's just going to be n plus one cubed. And here we have this one. Uh, it's alternating, so I'm just going to write my alternating sign. And then. Uh, I can write this over 1. So 1's on top. I don't care about the negatives now because I took care of it with this. And it's just going to be 1 over n. The a sub 1. Again, just write it down and make sure your index numbers here are matching. Okay? And um, this one is the last one. And might want to try it, but this is a sub 1, a sub 2, a sub 3, a sub 4, and so forth. So it's alternating signs. So I'm going to use this alternating sign. And I know that um, these uh, index numbers match here. So that's just going to be n. And the denominator is one more. So that would be n plus 1. And that would be your answer. And that's all. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.